Okay. Watch your heart and your feet. Narrow turn. On top of Detroit. Tall guy here, and the Fort Shelby Hotel is a red and white one, put Cadillac, pyramids on it. It's kind of a mishmash, you know, like most American cities are. I mean, Detroit was founded in 1701, you know, most of what you see was built in the 1920s. But at the same time, you've had a lot of infill, you've had a lot of stuff in the 50s go in. Um, the tall black granite one is says 1001 Woodward there. Uh, you know, that was the 1950s. They tore down the city's second skyscraper and built that. You know, but then you've had some newer stuff like that really kind of ugly neo-gothic looking one. You know, that went in in the late 90s. So I mean, it's kind of like a, you know, kind of a hodgepodge, a mishmash. <laughs> well, there's, an, there's a, uh, uh, an urban garden growing there, yeah. but I don't think that anybody intended no. that. No, no. There's just trees growing, the growing on top of the building. Yeah, and that happened. Um, it happens more often here than you think, but <laughs> you can also see on the world circle, like from here you can see where that brick is falling. It's far from a dead city, it's just, you know, it's not New York, it's not Chicago, but I don't think that there's any Detroiter that wants to be New York or Chicago. I think that most of us are proud to be Detroiters and 